Hi, today's topic is art and pop-ups. Not art that's three-dimensional, like this James Ritzy behind me, but pop-up books about art and by artists. Let's go take a look at some of them. Today in the vault, we have several titles that involve artists and their pop-up work. Included among these titles are ones on Escher, Parrish, Rockwell, Da Vinci, Red Grooms, Monet, and a book about art that pops up. Let's take a closer look at some of these titles. Here's a walk through Monet's garden, fully popping up, showing greenhouses and pathways and trees. Next to that, we have Red Groom's Rodeo, an incredible pop-up with all sorts of fun action from this wonderful artist. Continuing a closer look, here's a scene, a very famous scene by Maxfield Parrish in 3D. Next to it, a 3D version of one of Escher's Mobius strips. Moving back several centuries, we go to a 3D version of The Last Supper. And then completely different into the 20th century is this wonderful piece. So far, we've looked at mass-produced pop-up books, but there's also a wonderful category of handmade and limited edition books. Here is one that was produced only in quantity of 125, a lovely carousel kind of book. It's called St. Ostrich in Manhattan, The Visitations of a Martyr from 1990. And in another 1990 title, I have Beth Thielen's Words Spoken in Prison to an Artist. This is probably my most valuable pop-up book. It was produced in a limited edition of 10 handmade copies. I think the bulk of the rest of them are in major museums. Beth was an artist working in California prisons. Each of these pop-ups was conceived um, and imagined by talking to one of the uh, women prisoners that she was teaching art to. It's a very thought provocative book, as well as having beautiful artistry and imagery. Well, that's it for today. I hope you've enjoyed this pop-up tour of art in 3D.